going on, everybody? This is John Bade. Well, I welcome you to Last Oasis. Well, a story that happened in Last Oasis. Hope you guys are doing pretty good today. I'm doing good myself. Don't want to forget to mind you all to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you can be here when stuff happens because here's a little story for you. Um, well, we this is some time we had on the content creator server. The footage you're seeing is the uh, Masonator, Warmonger, and myself uh, getting in a little PvP action and stuff like that. But uh, this story happens after the fact, after we logged off. Um, also, shout out to Vernzi. Uh, they are the people that I was able to get the footage from because when the story happened, I didn't have my recording software up, but it was hilarious. Ended up, uh, shout out to Steffi for finding them and then um, proceeded to go and, <laughs> and tell them thank you for the great times. But anyway, make sure to check out Vernzy. There's a link down below to their channel. And anyway, let's get on with the story. So uh, after we logged off for the night, I tried to go to bed. I couldn't sleep, so I was like, uh, screw it. We'll just go ahead and run around and see what we can do because the server was getting wiped anyway. So I jumped on our stiletto, uh, traveled to a different tile, was kind of riding around and saw a couple people doing things here and there, nothing major. And then all of a sudden, I saw four or five people behind me on a dinghy running me down. And I was by myself on the stiletto and I uh, did what like, any other person with a little bit of common sense would do. Was I bolted. <laughs> Uh, as I continued to run away from them, there was this huge, uh, well, two dinghies and a, uh, spider walker cut them off a little bit. They actually, the spider walker pretty much ran into their dinghy, uh, that, the people that were chasing me, and slowed them down a bit, and I hightailed, took a left, and it was actually, it was trying to go to the edge of the map, but I saw a trading post in front of me, and they were still behind me. So I went straight to the trading, the trading post. Uh, there's a 15 minute timer there where you can't get attacked. And um, I pulled behind it and I AFK'd real quick. And then when I came back, this happened. He's alive. We can knock him out or he can give us the nipple clamps. Or... Wait, you want nipple clamps? Oh my God. Oh, you're under my boat. Hello. He, he didn't realize I was on here. I I am injured. I came over here and left and came back. Good evening. How are you doing? over the cliff. Wait, um, so uh, here's the deal, really. My friend is pushing here. Uh, nipple clamps or uh, he's going to push you over the cliff, apparently. Oh, I don't mind going over the cliff or nipple clamps. I'll take either one. I mean, no, we're no, we're no, not no, giving we're not nipple clamps. No, we're don't, not no, we're not, no, we're not, we're not, no, we're not. Wait, promise nipple clamps. We're not. No. What is, what is we are. Holes? We are not. You said you yeah, gave me clamps. What the hell is? Chill, 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 chill. We are this, not. Why are you changing the whole thing? We are, we are demanding nipple clamps. We need nipple clamps. Yeah, Our brother no, no, Eduardo. You no, no. What are you going to change the story? You want nipple clamps? And then I'm like, sure. No. Well, story. It's a narrative. Yeah, the narrative. I mean, let me, you know, I mean, I can go a little further that Eduardo needs the nipple clamps so that he can be clamped onto the front of the sh You see, Eduardo. I mean, if you've got a guitar that fires... Keep fucking pushing him. If you've got flames. What? No, I'm not gonna... No, I, I just sorry. I'm sorry. Actually, you got me excited. I was looking for some nipple clamps well, here, then you guys your said nipple, you don't got any. Well, no, well, okay, so now you're confusing me that I want my nipple clamps and... Oh, well, Eduardo's gonna be disappointed. Um... Um, brother, brother Toast, please be careful. I'm also on here. Brother hey, Toast. This is kind of fun. Um, I'm going to hold on. You may want to hold on to something. He's taking us. And Eduardo. Did he seriously just stick the landing? <laughs> that was brilliant. I too stuck my landing. <laughs> you dick. <laughs> Go find that man. I think he has nipple clamps. <laughs> and then I drove off into the sunset without a care in the world. <laughs> um, <laughs> hopefully you guys like the story. Uh, they never ended up fighting me. It was a great experience. Uh, you know, things like this don't happen. You know, they happen, but they're like this exact thing will never happen again. So, and it was pretty funny. Figured I'd share with you guys. Tell me down below what you think about what happened. Um, and again, another shout out to Vern Z for, uh, for helping create an event that was not planned. That was pretty funny. And either way, thank you so very much. And you guys... Have a good night.